This is a video to show one of the Masso members how I set the scribe up on the plasma cutter. The pneumatic cylinder is here. That's just welded on with a um, like a T piece here coming out for the bracket to hold on. And it just screws on at the back there. Just here. The um, it's a size twenty uh, linear rail. It's it's got enough strength in it to hold it, so it doesn't wobble. If you feel you need it to be stronger than that, I'd suggest putting two linear blocks on to um, strengthen this up, so it doesn't wobble. The uh, describe. You could probably go for a, a higher quality than this. It's uh, it stops now and then, but the main reason is is the air tube here. It's um, very thin. So what I've done is I've put the solenoid, the air solenoid, in under the cover here, and I run the full size air hose down through the tracking, and it's just here. Just there, the full size hose. So I'm not running a solenoid back here or in the control box. Um, I've got the, the larger airline running all the way up to here, and then from here, the um, it goes into a small tube here. This one, just there, runs through a um, an oiler. Automatic oils. Um, this is it when it goes down. It comes down, and under here, under there, I've just got a plate welded, uh, bolted on, and the linear block actually hits down on it, and it's got a rubber stopper as well so it doesn't thump down too hard uh, that's about it <clears throat> the the air solenoid it actually um, it um, just has a power from the masso uh, from the power goes through the solenoid and back into the masso input so that's all that's needed <clears throat> It doesn't have anything else done to it. It's just two two wires. <clears throat> oh, I'm dying. Yeah, that's that's about it. Just an aluminium block here to make it stiff so it doesn't wobble as well. That's uh, ten mil thick, I think it is. So that's about it. If if you get your um, coating right. This won't lift and come down every time you want to um, scribe something. It'll stay down the whole time and the whole the whole um, Z axis will go up and down and won't it doesn't turn this off. It stays on the whole time. So if you get your um, coding right in sheet cam, you'll get it to stay down the whole time. And that way when it when it goes down it goes down gently. It doesn't actually hit on the um, on the metal too hard. It just goes down gently. If if the coating is that it goes up at the end of the scribe, then comes down, it bangs, and it thumps the metal too hard, which doesn't do anything any good. This actually drops it down, and then the Z axis uh, lowers down to the sheet, and then it starts scribing. So that's that's about it. This video has got a bit long, so that's that's how it looks there with the rail, and I've just got the airlines running up through the um, the uh, tracking, whatever it's called. I've forgotten its name already. It's been so long since I did did this, but yeah, that's it. Thumbs up.
goes down and I just have this um, clip on there just to hold it when I'm when I'm not um, when I don't have the air hooked up to it so that's not continually hooked up to it it's just when I want to do scribing so that's it I'll send off some details to you as well